The fact that this is real is just wild. In 1959, US Vice President Richard Nixon was in the Soviet Union helping introduce them to American products and culture when he got into a heated argument with Soviet leader Nikita Khrushchev. Their conversation escalated so much that the Vice President of Pepsi, who was there as well, had to actually intervene and offer Nikita an ice cold Pepsi to calm him down. The Soviet leader liked the drink so much that he soon began trading vodka for enormous quantities of Pepsi to be imported into the Soviet Union. Before long, the Soviets were drinking more than a billion servings of Pepsi every single year. But soon, the Pepsi industry had grown so large there that vodka was no longer enough to pay for the imports. Since the Soviets' currency was pretty much worthless back then and they were incredibly desperate to keep their soda drink, they decided to offer Pepsi 17 submarines, a cruiser, a frigate, and a destroyer in exchange for $3 billion worth of Pepsi. Pepsi agreed and briefly became the sixth largest military in the world before selling it all. What's crazy is that Nixon's initial argument with the Soviet leader that sparked all of this was actually staged by him and Pepsi as a marketing tactic. 